at it with another video. I'm going to talk to you about how to travel um, and keep traveling, making money. So basically, where you start out um, is the money that you have. What kind of resources do you got? So basically, you need a job, a temp job or a seasonal job working somewhere. Um, <clears throat> Then once you rack up for money for like six months, let's just say, um, then use that money to be traveling for, I don't know, four to six more months, other months. Um, travel for six months, um, then come back, do the same thing. Just keep, you know, going, going like that. Um, what I'm gonna do is basically start my bus trip going to Florida and then work there then go travel city to city um, and find temporary jobs uh, temporary housing or if I sleep in my tent that's what I'll do because um, I got all my camping gear and equipment um, but yeah uh, the second thing is get out of debt. You need to get out of debt in order to have a travel lifestyle because it's going to hold you back and you're just going to have bills to pay anyways. So get rid of your debt, get rid of your bills. Um, me, uh, personally, I do not, I do not own a home. I don't own a home. I don't own a car. And I have no bills, so that's good. So, all the money that I work for, I get to keep it. And then that makes it so much easier to save and actually, like, go places, you know, with that money. So, um, <clears throat> really, that that's all you got to do, really. Um... Other thing is, uh, I don't have a wife or kids, so I, I mean, I don't, I mean, I'm single, so that's why I'm gonna, um, do my travel lifestyle now before I get to the age of where, um, I want to settle down and whatnot, maybe in the country or something, I don't know. Um, but yeah, other than that. Uh, it's not as hard as you think, really. It's just you got to, you got to have your equipment too, um, like camping equipment, electronics, and get out there and start uh, getting jobs, look for listings, make your money. Um, basically... You're basically um, in the low budget spectrum. It's like you're a traveling hobo, pretty much. Because what happens is, uh, to, in order to save money, you might have to sleep in a tent, uh, boondock, or like if you have a van, boondock somewhere. Um, West Coast is good for like vans and RVs because there's a lot of BLM land. Um, and uh, parks and everything like that. But um, I'm starting the East Coast right now. And yeah, so um, basically in a couple weeks, I'm going to Florida. So um, then that'll, I'll just start my journey from there. Uh, gonna share a lot of videos with the guys. I really hope to see all of your comments uh, just want to see how you guys feel about my videos and stuff like that so all right guys see y'all later see you on the other side peace